Ricky. On Corey. All these numbers. What do they mean? Oh, different things. Instructions, mostly. Instructions for what? Well, there could be a pilot down somewhere. Uh, the numbers could be coordinates for picking him up. Or maybe for blowing up a Nazi supply train. Things like that. Sabotage? We could have blood on our hands. For Holland. Does that make it right? Lying, stealing, killing? Whatever helps Holland is right. You need the message on Corrie. They're waiting. What will we be like when this is over? Thank you for being so prompt. I've heard a great deal about you, about your work. I'm afraid it is my father's work. Not the watchmaking. Your other work. You mean with the children? We've had to disband the class. Mr. Bourne, many of us who are in no position to publicize our feelings are in great sympathy with what you're doing. People call your house God's underground. Are you trying to trap me, sir? Using the name of the Lord is not the way. If it were a trap, you would be down the hall talking with the Gestapo. This will go no further. And why did you send for me? I want you to pass this man's name on to your friends. Who is he? Businessman. He betrays people to the Gestapo. The going rate is 75 guilders a head. Just pass it on. They'll take care of him. If I could do what you ask. It would be the same as killing him myself. I can only put him in the hands of the Lord and ask the Lord to reach his heart. Do that, Mr. Bond. out tonight. A 
would assume you could sleep through anything. Some tea? Thank you. Stubborn, tough, determined. You still don't do your share of the work? We are the same, yes. But I am more so. So, I win. Did you know that I have a wife and a small son? Precisely. I do not choose to expose myself. They got away. At least I think they did. I will not go around like the others, begging for sympathy and reassurance. You know so little about each other. You busy yourself with our needs. Surely you have some needs of your own. It's people like us, Mr. Embo, raging torrents behind the stubborn jaw. No torrents. You might say my life has been boring. Till all this. Until all this. Was marriage never considered for the daughter Stenbo? Betty was always unwell. She was told she could not bear children. So she chose not to marry. And you? I had a young man. But I was not cut from fine enough cloth for his family. I lacked grace. Still, I was the first woman to be licensed a watchmaker in Holland. <laughs> and you have your father. And you have your religion. Is it enough? More than enough. God has been good to me. Yes, sir. I think he has. And I think I shall be going back to my bed. I will pray for your family. Don't think that you will get me to peel potatoes, Miss Dembo. Need to repair? I need 600 gills. I've heard your certain contacts. I don't understand. It's my wife. She's been arrested. 